Journal of the American College of Cardiology, 2004. It's echolucent carotid plaques where they predict future events. Now, Ari and I have both mentioned, you can see these calcium flecks start to form as you begin to stabilize a plaque. This is the actual picture. It's not subjective at all. Again, unstable, soft plaque, very little calcium, stable, calcified plaque. And again, if you're struggling with, is that subjective or not? Look, these guys actually even took a visual analyzer and said, okay, you know, the visual analyzer found that this is a soft plaque. This is a hard plaque. So again, this is not subjective interpretation. Now, what happens with people that have soft plaque and hard plaque? The N was 112 with one and 103 with the other. Forget about the $5 word echo lucent that confuses the heck out of people. This is what's called a Kaplan-Meier lifespan curve. Basically what happens is people are starting here at one and if they have an event, they drop one person and then they're down to here. If they have another person have a heart attack, they drop here. Another heart attack, another heart attack, another heart attack. So the people that had soft plaque, in other words, the people that had this, this is what happened to them. Event, 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 event. And when I'm saying event, I'm talking about heart attack, heart attack, heart attack, heart attack. In the beginning, we did have a couple of events with the earlier group, but as you see, four compared to 29. Again, very, very clear science, very clear evidence. You'd say, well, I don't want to have any events. <laughs> well, I don't either. <laughs> but again, we're talking about the science and the information that's available.